Hi everyone, Sue's Journal Adventures here with a little project. Um, I guess you could call it a belly band, I guess. Is that straight? So I've got just a piece of card, coffee dyed. It's um, coffee splattered as well. It's really cool actually, I like it. Um, I, I've been saving this piece of card. I don't quite know what I've been saving it for, but um, I think its day has come. Do you, do you have those nights where you just don't really know what to do? <laughs> I've been sat here faffing about on my desk for ages, just messing. So, yeah, I actually finally made some. Well, I did. I, I had this urge to put a piece of coffee dyed paper into an acetate bag. I don't know why. Stuck a cluster on the front and made a booklet. That is about the limit of my creativity tonight. <laughs> oh no, no, I made a pocket out of a diary page. Just a little, you know, just a little sewn pocket with bits off my desk on it. That's about how creative I am at the moment. So this is going to be my background and it requires some inkage, inkage. It kind of looks not straight to me for some reason. Let me just get the bottom. I can't even see these lines properly on this grid. I need another mat where I can actually see it is straight. I think it's because the coffee goes off to one side maybe. That's what I'm telling myself anyway. I tell you, what am I like today? I've just, my creativity is gone. It's run off, run off with what we call spring here in England. We're actually having fake spring at the minute. This is not the real spring. We're having the fake spring. The fake spring is where the daffodils come up and the tulips come up and crocuses and hyacinths and they all start coming out and budding and blossom trees are in bud and and little birdies have come back and they're all singing the little hearts out and you think yay spring's here and then the temperature drops and your flowers drop and birds are flying around looking for extra feathers it's like what the heck's going on one minute it's sunny and blue sky outside and next minute you've got your eating on again because you're absolutely freezing. It's like, what is going on? <laughs> what? What is going on? I don't actually know. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, it's there. I'm going to say there's a stamp. It's been on my desk for days. I'm going to lose it now. I want it. Uh, I'm just going to do a little added background to this Um because I quite like the splatterings. So I'm just going to do bits, not not lots. Just bits of something here and there. Um, bits of a flourish, actually. Yeah, it was, um, it was a bit foul today, actually. It's been raining most of the day. But yesterday, it was lovely. Blue sky, warm. Yeah. And then next thing you know, it's absolutely freezing and you've got the heating on again. You're like, what is going on? What is going on? I do not know. Do I want another one of these? Maybe just a bit there. Oop, maybe I want some of this. I kind of want to screw shit. I don't want to, I don't want like big square blobs of it. So I'm just going to gonna do scrooching of it scrooching scrooch scrooch whoops hey come back ink we need you have i done that i kind of looks i don't know maybe i did do it maybe it's just some script over a bit of a coffee blob. There we go. I think that'll do. Keep this here because I will need it again shortly. Just let me get my glue stick. 
and just blob some glue on there so it actually sticks to the thing because I don't want it falling off when I'm trying to do my next bit. Oh, yeah, that was bright. So, right, so what's my next bit? Right, my next bit requires a square punch. If you haven't got a square punch, just cut some out by hand. If you're good at cutting, I'm not good at cutting. And I'm going to do four, hoping that I've done this piece of thing long enough. Yes, I, I think I have. Don't throw that away because that can also become something. I mean, you could, if you've got them handheld punches, you could put little holes right down the sides. It could look like a film reel, couldn't it? A film reel. Um, here's one I made earlier. <laughs> I'd actually just tore the edge off, but I thought we'll keep that because just, you know, I keep all the bits, don't I? And then I punched some circles out, so I kept the circles. And then I punched four more squares out of this and I'm like, ooh, little specimen booklet. Ooh, yeah, I don't throw anything away, I'm ridiculous. So these are going to be pockets. Now then, these are card. I did them. Oh no, I did them out of paper last time, and when I'd done them, I thought, "So you really should have done them out of card because they're meant to be pockets." But now they're actually out of card. I'm thinking, I don't think my punch is going to punch through all four, so that I get the holes in exactly the same place. I don't think it's going to punch through that. Mm -mm -mm. Oh no, oh well, we're just going to have to do it, aren't we? So I'm going to try and get it in as straight as I can so that the hole kind of sort of punches in the middle. Please, I hope. Oh, not bad, not bad. I've just got to do that again, that's all. <laughs> oh, why do I do these things? Right, there we go. There we go. Are we in? Are we in? Are we are we kind of same-ish? Please be same-ish. Oh, there we go. Wow. Blooming heck, even I'm shocked. <laughs> <laughs> so save these, because these come in handy, don't they, for things. Oh, I wonder if those little flowers would look nice on there. I stamped a load of flowers on vellum the other night, playing with me. I just do some random stuff now and then. I do random stuff a lot, actually. Um, so with these, I'm just going to get these here in a little, in a little, I'm seeing which way they, they kind of go the same, don't they? That and that. That's slightly off centre, but I can live with it. And then I'm going to get my big stamp again. Yay! And put loads of ink on it. Because last time it didn't stink up. Stink? What is it with me and stamping and inking? It didn't stink very well last time. <laughs> stamp very well either oh dear me it's late it's late i'm tired and yeah yeah i'm gonna make sure it gets on this time <laughs> oh dear what am i on about stinking and stamping and inking and i don't even know i'm tired i am tired Right, there we go. I've got, oh, will you stay over there? I've got four little pockets. Now I need some acetate that's been floating around my desk. Um, oh, I'm not going to get two out of that. I'm a cheeky leaky. I'll put it on and trim it. So, um, I need some more. There we go. Oh, that's the end of a packet. But it should be okay should be okay i just need that bit there it's really hard when you're working with this stuff in it because you guys can't see it we can see it a bit 
you just need four little pieces. That's big enough. That's big enough. And I'm going to stick them down and then chop them. Because last time I chopped them while they were on there, which didn't go very well. This is the only problem is you can't see them when you put them down. <laughs> it's like, where's my piece of acetate gone? Right, so I'm going to just stick these down on the other side. What's that? That's a bit old one. So I'm just going to stick these down. It doesn't have to be stuck amazing. Just stick it on there. So what I'm actually making is, um, well, I guess it's like a specimen type belly band. I just, I had this idea of specimen cards and specimen cards have been done like a million times by people. But then I saw this um, Pinterest. I'm always going on Pinterest. I see lots of interesting things on Pinterest. And you know what's really interesting to me about Pinterest is I saw myself on there. <laughs> I really wasn't expecting that. Um, I was scrolling the other day and I'm, I came to this pocket and I'm looking at the paper and I'm thinking, oh, I've got that paper. And then I'm looking at the pocket and I'm thinking, hang on a minute, I did that pocket. And when I clicked on it, it was actually me. I'm like, oh, okay. How did I get on Pinterest? I've got no idea. I think YouTube must put you on there. It must just, I don't know, share things with Pinterest. But yeah, I saw myself on Pinterest. I'm like, oh, well, that's unusual. But yeah, I saw this little project um, and it was, it was actually a tag. It was actually, I think it was a tag. It was a little tag with these window pockets. So I thought, oh, that's cute. That's a cute idea. Let's give it a go. Give it a go. So I'm just making a little window. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought I'd done something wrong then, but I haven't. You'll be pleased to know that I haven't. <laughs> For a change. Oh, can't cut it properly. It's funny stuff, this acetate, isn't it? Right, I need to get all these little bits out of the way. My poor journal is currently sat in the bin. Not because I don't like it. It's just, there's no room on my desk at all. <laughs> It's like I've been working in it and I'm like, well, where do I put it? So it's currently upside down in the bin at the minute. Poor little journal. I've been trying to... I've got ideas. I've got loads of ideas. But sometimes when I come up here, I just can't... I don't know. It's like they all fly out of me. I just sort of... So that's why I've been sat messing with silly bits of paper and all the bits that I had out the other day when I was doing the um, stamping little pieces of paper video. Well, they're still all here <laughs> because I haven't put them away because I keep looking at them and thinking, oh, interesting, interesting bit of paper that. Can't find out interesting to do with it though at the moment. My brain's gone to sleep for a few days I think so anyway I did do a project tonight I did my funny little booklet thing with a plastic bag I don't know why it would have been nice if I could have sewn around the edge of that oh yeah oh I did try to do some sewing earlier but my I think I've come to the realization that my sewing machine it doesn't like slippy, slippy things. It doesn't like acetate. It doesn't like vellum. It doesn't like sewing things like that because, <laughs> well, for an unknown reason, I was trying to sew <laughs> tea bags. Okay. Oh, gosh. I was trying to sew 
baking paper. Well, baking paper is quite slippy. It's this stuff here. I know you know what baking paper is. But it's nice and crinkly, but it's slippy. But I was trying to screw up a tea bag so it were a bit scrunched. And then add a vellum flower on the top and sew straight down the middle and add like a line of them. But my sewing machine really didn't like it. It just, it was just chewing up the that that stuff that I can't think of the name of now. I've just said it. Um, yeah, very bizarre. It doesn't seem to like acetate and stuff. It's, uh, now then let me get these right way round because... I don't want the writing upside down. Let's make sure I've got them the right way. Oh, that's upside down. So I have absolutely no idea what I'm talking about now. I know I was on about seeing a little pocket on Pinterest. <laughs> a pocket that had little windows and I thought, oh, that's cute. I kind of want to do something like that. So this is my take on it. Um, yeah, I don't know. I've lost the plot. I'll just sit here and rock backwards and forwards and hum to myself. <laughs> I don't know what I'm on about anymore. Oh, dear me. Oh dear, we're in a bit of a gluey mess. Bit of a gluey mess tonight. Gluey, gluey mess. Oh, yuck. Right, so this, this is a fairly easy project. You only really need some bits of card, any card, doesn't matter. I've chosen to go with the neutrals again. Um, but it can be anything. Um... A square punch if you've got one and a circle punch if you've got one. If you haven't, just draw around something square and cut it out and draw around something circular and cut it out like a, like a little leg or something. There we go. So we've got all these little pockets now. How lovely. What are we going to put in them? I don't know. I had another piece of card here a minute ago. Is that it? That's it. Mm, I don't think I'm going to get far out of there. But why not? You only need them thin. Thin, thin, thin. Cut it, Sue. Cut it. How thin do I need? <laughs> Sorry. Are these even straight? I can't see. I think they are. There we go. So I only need them because bearing in mind we've got glue in there. Pencil, a pencil would be nice. I only need them about that thick. Maybe. Maybe. Hopefully. So let's just cut that on the mark, on the line. And I think I'm probably only going to get maybe a two out of that am I? Will it fit? Will it fit? Oh yes it will. Oh that came out of window. That where's my window gone? Oh it's there. <laughs> okay, so I'm probably gonna get one. I might be lucky if I get three out of there. Do we reckon? Do we reckon? I don't know. Maybe just to like there. And then that one's going to go in to there, to there. Oh, yeah, I think we're going to get three. Well, hey, we're going to get three out of it. So I might as well just, I'll just not even bother if they're the same size. Although I should bother if they're the same size, but I'm not bothered. Oh, they're really not the same size. And then I need this one again. I need a spare one, don't I? So, there, there. Okay, okay. And chop that off. And chop. I've lost my line. 
there. So that one's a bit short. But them similar. They're pretty similar then. So we'll try and aim for that size then. Try and aim for that size, shall we? And then I'll do it and it'll probably all be too big. But anyway. Bits go back in the bits box. And ever increasing bits box. Right. So I've got these now to make little tags with. Yep. Yep. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, so what am I going to do with these? I... Watch out for low flying circles. I'm going to put them on here. Um, no, you can't do that, so you need them that way. You need them that way, lovey. Okay. Okay. Right. And we're going to ink this up again. Sorry if you're rocking about up there. You're not meant to be rocking about up there, whoopsie. And we'll squoosh this down again. And then I want some ink. I didn't even show you what we're making, did I? I make a prototype and then I forget to tell you or show you. So the prototype is here. <laughs> this is it. So these tags, um, I've only inked the top just to make it look like a little tab. But they are little tags and they do fit in their little pockets. So it's kind of like a little specimen bookmarky, belly bandy, edge of page pocket thing. Um, and I can't do all four of these at once. I know I can't. And that is wonky. So I don't know what. Let's get this straight. There's no point cutting something that's wonky. Right, so I'm just going to make little corners. And I really should measure them because eyeballing corners is not, not my best thing, really. In fact, I probably really shouldn't eyeball out because I'm not that good at it. But there we go. They look like tags to me. And that'll do nicely. I'll just get all this junk off my desk. So, then I just want some pretty little flowers. Yeah, so all I did to make it look like a tab at the top was just ink it because I couldn't be bothered putting a tab on it, basically. <laughs> That's the truth. I could have made little tabs for them, but I kind of be bothered doing that. Not really. <laughs> Not really. Um, now I want some little flowers. There's just, I think these are going to be too long. Why do I feel like, oh they're not, they're actually perfect. Oh my goodness, they're actually perfect Sue. <laughs> Why do you sound so surprised? Just give it a bit of inking, got to ink everything. You know, but well, you don't. You don't have to ink anything. If you don't wish to, you don't have to. If you don't have ink, you don't even have to worry about it. You can draw around with pen or eyeshadow, or you could even get your little black pen out and just draw some faux stitching around the edge. That'd look really nice, I think. I think I might need some ink on it. I might just. You know, need a bit of ink, of the inking. There must be tons of ink in this thing, actually, but just probably need a spritz. There we go, that's that. So, what are we going to do on these? I think we're going to just... Oh, I could have some hearts on them, since I have some punched out hearts. Oopsie. Don't really show up a right lot, do they? Can't see. No. No. Okay. Yeah, you can. They, these are doing my head in. 
these are stickers but some of them are stickers and some of them are not so some of them are cut out and you can just get it like that all nicey nice and then you get another one and it's like it's not even cut round i'm like what is going on with these is that one a sticker oh my days i don't actually know some of them you've got to cut round and some of them are stickers this looks like a sticker oh, it is good whoops but it's pulling a bit of that other stuff off so yeah i'm just using little stickers just to pretty them up um what else have i got oh you you'll do are you a sticker oh you look a bit dodgy you look like you go on to something else. Oh, what's that? What's happening here? I think I'll leave that one. <laughs> I don't like it. I don't like you. I'm sorry. Not pretty. I think, shall I have that? Oh, why not? I haven't flipping used the stickers in years, so just get them used. I don't know why I hoard things so uh, yeah, but I really like it. I know you really like it, but when are you going to actually use it? <laughs> well, I'm going to use it now. There we go. I need a little tiny bit snipping off the top. And a little tiny bit snipping off the bottom. And then we just need one more. Which could be you. It could be you. Oh, that doesn't look like it's cut. Well, we never know till we try, do we? It is cut. Oh, only so far, though. There we go. That's pretty. I've lost me. That's uh, I'm going to say I've lost my drawer. How can you lose a drawer? Mind you, on this desk. Flipping heck, I could use, lose one at cats on this desk. It's that bad. Right, so here we go. Let's put these in our little pockets. Oh my days. These are, these are a bit longer than my last um, tags. They stick up a bit more. But that's okay. Actually, I think I need to ink the end just a little bit more. Just so it's a bit more defined. You need a bit more glue on you. There we go, get us little tags in. Actually, these fit in way better than the last one I did. I cut them a bit short on the last one. You stuck on my acetate. Hey, stop it. Oh, it obviously is. There we go, I've got the acetate now. There we go, it's done. Da -da! There we go, two little specimen type bookmark things. <laughs> I don't know what to call it. I don't know what to call it. It could be an edge, page edge decoration. It, oh, that's quite taller than that one. I hope it fits in my journal. I actually like, quite like them. Pretty cute. Yeah, um, so obviously decoration is up to you. That's where your creativity, I can't think of a word then, mojo kicks in. And you just do it how you're going to do it. But they are two pretty little specimen type belly bands, pockets, whatever, to... Um, just give you a little something different in your journal and obviously little things to interact with if that's the right word <laughs> anyway i hope you enjoyed that thank you very much for watching and i will see you on the next one where hopefully i remember my words i know what i'm talking about and i don't actually think that's going to happen but I'll see you soon. Bye for now.